Hi guys, welcome to Mishi Blue Tarot. This is Neela, and today we are going to be looking at what's happening behind the scenes for you. Okay, so just a sec, I will set up the camera. Yeah, much better now. Yeah, what's happening behind the scenes for you in general in your life? Um, this is an energy that I'll try to tune in to understand. If you've been going through a phase or whatever is happening, what's brewing up behind, okay? So pile number one will be this blue appetite. Okay. Pile number two will be this citrine point. And pile three will be this opalite palm stone. So you guys can pause the video, look at the crystals, the ones that are attracting you the most. Go ahead and pick your piles. I'll pause for two, three seconds. What's happening behind the scenes? Let's see for pile one. Here's your blue appetite. What's happening behind the scenes for file number one? Generation is what I'm hearing. Hmm. It's the first step towards what the universe wants to push you okay there is light at the end of the tunnel pile number one if something is falling apart then another thing is falling in place for you pile number one it just seems like you are prepared or being prepared for something bigger in life and that's what's happening behind the scenes for you and for this thing to be fully visible, this whole old thing has to crumble fully. Then only will you be able to see what is being made for you over here. What's happening? Yes, I do see fear. Okay. There was a lot of fear attached to this situation where you did not want to let this crumble or maybe you kept complaining or thinking that okay how do i do this i don't see anything but you had to do that so that this thing becomes visible the the vision was being blocked because you were not letting this crumble i hope i am like being able to explain this yeah it's more like the crumbling was important so that you could see and i'm sure little bit of it has happened and you can already see a lot very little bit has happened it's not like the major part of it is done or anything it's only a little part of it that has become visible but i still see fear what's brewing up for you is what you had always asked for. It's like the universe standing and saying that you asked for it. Now when it's there, why are you feeling scared? It is a fear. It was a fear. It still is a fear. But your fear was fear fueling this disaster i would say you more the more you fear the more difficult the situation will become stop fearing i'm just hearing this word that surrender to the universe just surrender yeah you're being asked to surrender 
not looking at the problem is not going to ch- make it non existent i do see that you are aware and you were conscious that this is the only way through which you can move towards that happiness yes it does require waiting i think you were just you were just not ready to put in time because you're scared that i might invest time and i'll ruin it for myself i might um i might just like put in li- uh, you there's fear basically fear of putting in time and just landing in the middle of nowhere it's like you probably were not accepting this because it will take time and you had to and it will require a storm so that was the reason for fear but the universe is trying to tell you what's happening behind the scenes for you is that it is crumbling you really cannot stop it i mean you're just holding on to something that will crumble that's what i'm seeing it will crumble it will fall off and no matter how hard you try actually the resistance is making it difficult for you the more you're trying to keep it away not look at it not address it the more difficult you're making it let's see what is this about by the way what is this crumbling about let's see ha ah. this could be about societal traditions this could be about keeping a certain dignity keeping a certain stature and the crumbling would lead to the would lead to the stature falling off what about the stature yeah you so basically you were doing things for people and in it was a very disbalanced equation here it's not a very balanced equation you kept doing doing but you have you were not understand you you think that if you allow this crumbling then you're the bad one or people might just consider you the one being bad or something like that that's what i'm channeling but why don't you get it that no one is going to even think everyone whoever you are considering important their opinion etc these people are only concerned about themselves they are just concerned that okay if this guy or girl goes or if this falls down how am i going to live or how are things going to sustain that is what is bothering here nobody over here is thinking about you i think behind the scenes there is a truth that will also come out i think this whole facade that is there about a person will come in front of you and then you know and you actually kept this situation in limbo for very long and behind the scenes this crumbling is going to you know it's like it's like you know when you pull out like you you're just kind of dusting away everything and then now you're seeing the picture clearer your your guilt will also go pile one your guilt will also go i'm seeing that guilt that fear of bringing about this change and all of that that is also going is what i'm seeing and behind the scenes this is happening you have to understand that every situation has to be balanced it cannot be disbalanced and here whatever you thought was important or whatever you thought was your responsibility but these are the same people or things that are just 
concerned about themselves nobody over here is thinking the way you are or maybe that's your nature i'm not trying to change your nature but try to understand that you shouldn't allow people to take advantage of your nature okay all right so that's what i have for you file number 1 i hope this reading helps private readings are open so you can reach out to me and let me know in the comments if this resonated okay take care i'll talk to you soon bye bye okay pile number 2 whoever chose the citrine point let's see what's happening for you behind the scenes what's happening behind the scenes there is a lot of silence around you right now but there's one line i want to tell you no movement is not no progress it is work in progress okay let's see what's happening behind the scenes yeah patience your patience at this point of time is shaping up your life it is opening the road map to something in your life uh pile 2 i think in the act of anger you will end up either going somewhere or opening something or throwing something which will have the answer to a big question in your life and this question is coming from your past maybe you have a misunderstanding about a particular person or a situation and that thing is being cleared behind the scenes that's what is happening yes um someone instigated you or somebody gave you a different picture about a situation and now you're getting to know the truth i actually see that you will revisit something yes yeah 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 you'll actually understand that who was the ultim who was the main reason why this happened or whatever happened here you will actually understand the reason somebody was directing your life all this while but yeah just go with the flow pile number 2 cuz your impulse is what is going to lead you to this place yes yes something something was hidden from you yeah out of i mean love which is like sort of manipulation is what i'm seeing um could be a lady could be a man also take it how it fits it is just sheer manipulation you were trapped in your own thoughts and maybe you love this person a lot and this person gave you a certain picture which wasn't true okay this is very specific i don't know how many of you would resonate with this but keep following your impulse i usually do not say it but this is a very immediate energy because i'm seeing swords so it's not like it will continue for a very long time um i'm just seeing that it will only last for a while this impulse but it will lead you to a truth for sure and that's what's happening behind the scenes somebody has to be sort of exposed uh their truth has to come in front of you yeah yes 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 your guides are actually guiding you
this person could have a lot of good reputation in the society or in your life in general but they have this one deep dark secret which has which was hidden from you and that will change your perception about this person and a lot of things in your life is linked to that this could be your father also mother or father some figure who you always kept at a pedestal Why is this happening to you? Let's see. Why is this cooking up right now? Why is this happening to you? Because you have to actually show the truth. You have to pull out your anger so that you can live a happy life and that's what the universe is orchestrating for you. Oh my god. So okay, what I see is that a situation was probably hidden or you were misled or you were not given the full truth about it and because of that you formed certain perceptions which have to change in your life now and which is why this situation is happening the way it is right now. You have to take out your anger. Whatever you hold inside you, all that all those feelings have to come out. All those emotions have to um go away from your system. You probably did not see the other side of the story and that's why the universe is doing this. Stay tuned. I think 29th of August. I don't know if, to, if today is 28th. So maybe tomorrow. No, actually, in fact, today is starting till tomorrow. Something might happen which will actually bring out some kind of a truth. Which where you have to burst out your anger so that your life changes. and it is linked with that situation so i don't know how many of you are being able to resonate with this reading maybe i'm supposed to speak to a specific person so please comment and let me know if this is making sense you have to talk it out you have to like like call the culprit the culprit and um call a spade a spade basically um i see this person whoever has been like manipulating this person has had this tendency not only with you but with other people also i don't know why am i picking up a parental figure for some reason but anyway that's what i have um i want to see a uh, advice for you because it seems slightly heavy to me what's the advice to file number 2 it is okay to choose your peace so if you feel after this anger release you want a break please take a break cuz i see that this is going to be slightly heavy on you maybe it's the super moon energy that is going to cause this but you should allow this release to happen don't hold your anger back okay pile 2 that's what i have um, i'm not asking you to go and fight but yeah this anger release is important this emotion anger is also an emotion okay that's what i have i hope this helps Let me know. Private readings are open, so you can reach out to me. Uh, take care, and I will talk to you soon. Bye bye. Okay, pile three. Whoever chose the opalite palm stone. Okay, let's see what's happening for you behind the scenes. You let the devil win every time. And I don't know what the devil is for you, but you let it win all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not learning the lesson, pile three, which is why patterns are repeating in your life. You're not learning patience. 
you're not learning to surrender i think i repeated this in parallel number 1 also you're not understanding the importance of time you're in a rush for everything and you let the devil win basically your biggest karmic lesson is to stay patient what's happening behind the scenes i know you might get angry about it but similar situations which test your patience are going to keep repeating till you don't change the way you react yeah you just react you just do it in the moment but what you don't understand is that you're ruining your own reputation uh you're ruining things for yourself and i'm actually seeing that other people have the potential to disrupt your mental peace they have the power and you have given this power to them somehow every time it is about patience you start feeling anxious that is the biggest trigger for you and the universe will recreate those moments for you because you are subconsciously asking for it that i want i want a result right away i want a result right away i want a... your emotions have to understand that they are not more powerful than you and you're not letting it understand you just react whereas love needs patience that's what you've been seeking and the day you come into this energy you really don't have to seek anything you will have it in your life you will not have to run behind it it will just be there around you but you're not understanding this you're just not wanting to be patient with life you're not being patient with yourself now even while watching this reading i know there would be some who would think that i've been patient forever forever is when you die <laughs> sorry to say it. but yeah forever is i mean a word which i've heard several times from my clients but till the time you're not getting something which means you are your energy is not aligning with the energy of that thing it's very simple So what's happening? Yes. Okay. This time your trigger is going to be slightly bigger. But let's see if you learn the lesson this time or not because the universe will keep repeating this and that's what's happening behind the scenes for you. There's nothing very big or a shifty kind of an energy. No. It's a very simple thing. You just have to trust and allow things to happen to you, but what you're doing is you immediately take action. Something happens, your reaction is just Two minutes away, but the universe wants you to wait. The universe wants you to stay and see and observe the flow of events. Why does it happen, and why is it happening the way it is happening? you will only be able to see the person when you see patience sad but true irony but true beautiful but true remember this and that's what's happening behind the scenes because you want love in your life and you're not willing to be patient that's what's happening over here and that's what's happening behind the scenes okay pal three that's what i have 
I don't think this is like majorly an advice only, so I don't think I need to pick extra cards for that. So private readings are open. You can reach out to me. Let me know in the comments if this made sense. Take care. Bye bye.